So I'm just sorting out the tree nursery. It's that time of year where you just have to go through stuff and weed. There's some Monterey Cypress that's two year old. And there's the one year old stuff. And here's some pine from this spring. And over there that's a beech that I grew on. I think it was two years ago, something like that. It might have been three, but they're growing on nicely. And what else have we got? That's an apple there. Yeah, when you when you're peeling home stored apples in March, the pips get really quite big, and sometimes you can see just a little shoot coming out the end of the pip time to uh, sow them. What else have we got? We've got some oaks. There we go. That's quite growing away quite healthily. I think that's grown seven, six or seven inches this year. Yeah. And down here, let me just see where we are. It's a little bit difficult to check in the viewfinder there's some more let me get rid of this there's some more Monterey Cypress here we are there we go yeah and in that pot there that is a walnut so it's a matter of going through them and just uh, weeding them out and picking out the good ones just in there there's some more pine that's last year's they're not growing that well but they're growing enough it just depends upon the seed source a lot of the times you'll get uh, oaks that really bomb away nice and straight and then you get other ones that are just decided to be I'm a hedgerow yeah so each in their own place Okay, that was just a quick update on the tree nursery. I'm going to spend the rest of the afternoon sorting these out, finding out whether some of them need potting on. You know, they might be starting to be root bound. Where we are on heavy clay, I sort of, and because we plant them in tubes and because we don't plant a huge amount every year, you know, we're not planting a thousand or 15,000 we might plant 50 or 60 so you can afford to pit plant them so growing them on in a pot but as long as the pot is big enough yeah and potting them on means that when you plant them out they have a good start I mean bare root is fine if you're on good soil but if you're on very dry or thin soil then or heavy clay then it's more difficult because it's about moisture moving through things and of course planting times and all that lot anyway a little bit of an update hopefully you've enjoyed this hopefully this may inspire you to this next winter when you're out walking collect some seed pot them on get them to grow look after them for a few years and then plant them out even if it's just gorilla planting and of course everywhere by the side of the road there's old plantings with with tubes in there and what have you so if you're going to do gorilla planting sometimes if you can put a tube around them at least it protects against mammalian damage but it doesn't protect it against humans catch up with you soon cheers for now